guys, we're gonna be doing Trucker's Kitchen this time, and we're gonna be doing some pork and bean soup. It's super simple. It's not just gonna fill you up, but it's gonna feed your soul and keep you going when you're out here on the road. So, really easy recipe. I have the pork tenderloin, chopped it up. We have some uh, great northern beans. You can also use some butter beans. Then we have some chicken broth. Then we're gonna go ahead and put all this pork in. And here are my spices. We have some garlic, pepper, and onion powder. I like to do it to taste. Let's go over some of the cook times real fast and the ingredients. I use two cans of great northern beans, one can of the chicken broth, and then what would be considered two pork chops, pepper, garlic, and onion powder. I'm gonna go ahead and push that soup button, and then you can cook them between 20 and 30 minutes for the time depending on which style beans you're using. And then you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you do the slow release option. Don't quick release it because it will not allow the beans to cook fully and get nice tender and everything blend together and taste amazing. Dump everything in there and you can do it while you're driving on the road and pull over later. Super simple. Just make your semi into a tiny house so that you can make cooking in the cab a whole lot easier. We love this lagoon table that we have and it just really makes it so much simpler. It's a table that we can eat on a prep station. And then also we are working on a dishwasher, a portable dishwasher. Let's explore this portable sink that I'm trying to improve. You push the button and you start rinsing the dishes. I already soaked them all up to speed up the process for you guys. to cook in the cab. If you want to know what the best skill it is for cooking in the semi, check out this video right here coming up next. Click that video, watch it so you can learn the best skill at the truck and why. All right guys, so stay safe, stay healthy, and enjoy this good food.